I was wondering how Maureen learns to read the Akashic Records. Uh-huh. Was, well, well, that's a big question. story. <laughs> that's a very big story. Um, uh, I took a class at one point, but I will tell you that I was told um, in meditation, actually in a lucid dream, that I was being given access to a dimension that had been closed to humanity for eons. And uh, I asked, was I the only one? And I was told no, but that I would be a way shower. So um, part of what I learned, I learned from another uh, teacher, but I dramatically changed the teaching itself and the uh, information because I was being given a lot of information because as a channel to source, I get a lot of information that just comes in. And so uh, it, the, the information that I'm teaching now at the level I'm teaching is a lot different than uh, what a lot of teachers are doing. There's lots of teachers teaching the Akashic Records. I'm not the only one. The next question is probably, well, how is what you teach different from? I have always felt that it goes back to another lineage that I taught years ago for a long, long time, for many, many years. And, it, and people would say to me, well, you know, there's lots of people teaching X, Y, Z. You know, why should I take it from you? And my response was always the same. Don't take my word for it. Go ask at the altar. Should I be studying with Maureen St. Germain or should I study with somebody else? Because I'm not the judge here. You are. I'm not the main event. You are. And that's the thing you will learn in the Akashic Records, that you're the main event. And when this starts to sink in, you begin to realize how powerful you are. So how is how are the records different? There's a number of ways, and I actually have, um, I have the ability to give you uh, a short list, but some of it won't make sense uh, unless or until perhaps you um, are working with me. But um, a lot of the teachers don't invoke the Ascended Masters. And I work very closely with the Ascended Masters, and I always have been very close to the Ascended Masters. Um, we also insist that we're only working with 100% God light. A lot of teachers just invite the energy in and hope for the best. They don't spe specifically demand that. Another thing that I teach that is not taught anywhere else is the higher self-connection. And the higher self-connection is a tool that I developed um, over the course of a number of years because I kept asking my higher self for a way to teach people how to connect with their higher self and get 100% accuracy. And so this is an additional skill that you will come away with. And that's amazing. It's a huge, huge tool because it gives you the ability to know what you need to know before you need to know it. It gives you the ability to make decisions and know for certain that you should take those actions. A lot of times people get intuition and people will say to me, oh, well, you know, I have a good intuition. I don't need that, that tool. And I laugh and say, do you follow it 100%? And when they say, well, no, because most people will say no, my response is then you don't believe in it 100%. You need this tool. This tool will give you accuracy to 100%. And that's pretty spectacular. It means you can always know what to do. And, and the thing about the higher self-connection, it is not so that you can know whether the weather will change or whether your friend will do something. It's so that you know what is in your highest and best good. And that's huge. That's enough. So is it my highest and best good to go to the movies with my friends tonight? Is it my highest and best good to enter this class at this time? Is it my highest and best good to invest in the stock market at this time? Those kinds of questions are very useful and very powerful. Um, and so none of this uh, is taught in the other classes. In addition, we have an essential oil blend called Akasha that was developed especially for opening up the Akashic Records and I teach people how to use it, and you can get that uh, as a resource to uh, help you with your progress. I also recommend that people get certain kinds of stones 
that they can use to enhance their practice. And that's really a kind of a fun thing. If you like crystals and you want to use crystals to enhance your progress, it, they will in very specific stones that are recommended. I teach you markers. Nobody else identifies markers. And what markers are are ways to know that you are in the Akashic Records. And I don't want to teach them now because I think that that's an easy way for people to, I'll use the word malpractice it. And instead I would ask you to come to the class and you will learn the markers that can establish without question that you're in the Akashic Records. It's pretty amazing stuff.